Oleg Znarok and the suspension to Znarok, who had that throat slash gesture yesterday. Uh, when asked if he could attend the game, yes, but he will not be able to be on the bench, nor can he be involved physically with the team prior to the game or during the game, and, and also includes the ceremonies after. Okay. Now, Znarok is wearing an earpiece. He could be just listening in. Perhaps he's listening to Bon Jovi. I'm not sure. But uh, that's the coach on the bench, too. And clearly, it looks like maybe there is some communication. We don't know. I mean, it's speculative. I don't know what he's listening to. Prove it. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you do anything to end a gold medal game. But I'm sure that's going to draw the attention of the double yeah. IHF. Yeah, I don't think it's a smart move. And, uh, you know, I was surprised even to see him in the building, I, to be honest with you, today, Rod. And, you know, they have not allowed him to even partake in any of the festivities after post game. So we'll see what comes out of this. I think he's just listening to our broadcast. That's all. Well, I'm very irritated when you see it as I think to 100% that Schnarog sits with Luren in the Åker taken i handen och kommunicerar med astränaren i båset garanterat som man inte får göra hela tiden. Vi ser till och med den lilla micken där som man försöker ha på värsta FBI-sättet. Och jag tycker det är tråkigt att ryssarna respekterar vad man får göra och vad man inte får göra.